Hey everybody, it's TK here, TK here to subscribe here to give my quick review and thoughts of episode 6 of Naruto. I always say it every single time on Baruto, Naruto Next Generations, on um, episode 6. Um, so this episode was pretty much uh, Shino um, trying to take out, well, pretty much kill Baruto, Shikadai, and Miss Miski. Does I say right? I don't know. I, I keep messing up on, that, on his name right there, but um, this episode pretty much it, it was uh, really expected to be. I thought they was going to be, you know, actually like trying to fight him, but this, you know, there was of course running. I know. I mean, it does make sense, you know, like she she knows the top. Uh, he's a, he's like Johnny's, you know, so it wouldn't really be smart to fight him. But um, this episode pretty much them um, uh, trying to figure out a way to take out uh, Shino. Um, and get the this mysterious evil chakra that's possessing him you know, to be gone like every incident that has occurred so far on the Baruto series um and yeah of course you know we they somehow was able to achieve that uh, pretty much well trying to recap everything that happens pretty much uh, Baruto and Shikadai uh, pretty much was the bait um, to like, get Shino towards the water and uh, once he used up all his insects Mitsuki pretty much he's he got he's like a Roshimaru of course so he, he got he could extend his arm super long and whatnot so he pretty much dragged him under the water he dragged Shino in the water and he had lightning style move he was dead and whatnot uh, then use up all his chakra, he almost drowned. Baruto came and just tried to save him. Baruto couldn't get up to the top. Uh, she could die from the goal in. But Shino came and uh, hopped in there and used the summoning juice on to get him out before either anyone would drown, you know. But um, yeah, it was a pretty decent episode towards the end. Uh, now that this thing has possessed someone of a uh, high caliber like Shino, uh, uh, he has discussed this with Naruto and Shikamaru and uh, they are finna look into this case and Naruto is asking Shino for his help and helping in um, find out what is this uh, mysterious uh, chakra thing that's coming around possessing people so yeah it, was, it wasn't that really too much of a big episode but it was a decent episode nonetheless um, I mean, I know Naruto and Baruto relationship isn't the best. I mean, if it took, like, if they had Baruto series start, like, after the instance on the movie, it would have been a little bit better. So, Baruto can come and talk to Naruto about this. Like, you like, hey, Dad, I've been seeing this mysterious shadow chakra thing possessing people. But it's not like that, so, uh... Yeah, he just he can't really him and Roto or any or talk about this type type of stuff. But maybe maybe um he'll try to talk to Baruto maybe try to talk to you know to once again about the um Byakugan and uh maybe she'll pass the info on to Naruto and and that's we'll see where that goes. But anyways, next episode is um focused on Chocho, which is Choji's daughter. Uh, it's a full episode, of course. But of course, we're going to see Baruto and, and uh, some other people that I've never seen before. But yeah, uh, Chocho episode. Can't wait for that. Can't wait. But yeah, I'm TK, TK, Dorscar. Tell me what you thought about the episode. I think the episode was okay. Like I said, nothing too big. Nothing really too exciting, you know. But it was a decent episode, nonetheless. Uh, like I said, we mentioned the part with the mysterious chakra thing. We're going to start getting investigated, so that's a big thing right there. But anyways, yeah, leave your thoughts in the comments down below. If you haven't already, go check out my other previous videos. I did Attack on Titan uh, video. I did Dragon Ball Super video. Check those out. But yeah, I'm TK. Do it those Thanks for tuning in. Until next time, I'll talk to you later. Peace.